flipping now. A chaparral home is still full of dogs three days after trying to get them all out into forever homes or euthanized. 208 dogs were discovered on Friday after the owner, Felix Moriel, was arrested for assault and battery and false imprisonment. Randy Wynn says he has Moriel's power of attorney. He also told us Moriel is accused of violently assaulting a 70-year-old woman. We now go to Ashley Rodriguez, who's live in front of the home at 805 Alice Marie. Ashley. Rick and Stella, since I've been standing here, a family has actually come up and offered to adopt a dog. And this has pretty much been the story of the afternoon. People trying to help out Randy Wynn, who is frantically trying to get these dogs off of his property behind me. And they're everywhere, in the backyard, in the home. There's dead dogs on the property. The barking is constant. The smell is rancid. And it has the neighbors complaining, which is why the Otero County Sheriff's have told Wynn that if this home isn't empty by tomorrow, the rest of the dogs will be put down. And so far, they have put a dent in the hoard. Just today, they've gotten rid of about 20 dogs. They're down to 30 left. About 100 dogs have been put into facilities, and 50 of the aggressive dogs were put down. This after 200, over 200 dogs were found on the property without food and water, some turning on each other and eating each other. And neighbors are really putting pressure on the sheriffs to clean this place up. I feel that we, could, we need to move faster here in this situation because these animals are suffering. Um, there's a lot in there still in the house that have no food, no water. There's still some animals in there that are dead. Um, it, we need to get the ball moving here. We've got to get these dogs out. We have the, I believe the sheriff is only giving the uh, amp time to get these animals out. If not, they're all going to be euthanized. So we need to get these animals out as soon as possible. We're asking the public to come out and help. Now, Felix Moriel is still in jail. Wynn tells me he's being held on a $25,000 bond. And in the meantime, Wynn is just trying to get this property clear of the dogs so that they don't have to be euthanized by tomorrow. In Chaparral for our New Mexico Mobile Newsroom, Ashley Rodriguez, back to you. Okay, we'll keep checking you out. Thank you very much. Ashley.